Hey, we can't use that. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pass, you take it. Nah. Give you that gold, boy. I'm actually using an axe very similar to that on my, uh, my hunter. It's funny we got it so early. <laughs> I'm like, you little prick. You're like, what'd I do? <laughs> what? <laughs> Not ready yet. Can you get something called the Rune of Duty? Rune of Perfection? Rune of Perfection. Old by... I can't carry it. Chicken Ashenville for two gold. Oh, Jason. So I found out when I went to go to like use my footage that was like four hours long from us just playing in that video i just made it literally when i would load it into premiere pro it would try to conform the entire video into my ram which would destroy my computer right like immediate just gone and it wouldn't recover it would like i had to restart it so i figured out that i have to like cut the footage with a vitamux before i can put it into premiere pro super weird Probably, huh. you know what? I'm probably not picking up dust bat pelts, literally because I just have crap in my bags, and that's why. Uh, have you? Did you know, Ryan? No, I'm, I'm getting can, them. You can Let free me know up bag spaces as a shaman. I have all the dark, uh, dark hand blood. Cool. You can get rid of one of your totems because there's a there's the relics that you put in your relic slot count as the totem, whatever relic it is. Should we fight this missionary right here? So you can put a totem in your bags into the relic slot. No, no, no. Like, uh, like later down the line, right? When you get relics or totems for shaman, you know, kind of like how paladins have like the books that they can get in their in their like range slot. Yeah. We get like a totem you put, and you can free up a bag space by putting that totem like in your bank, and then you just like wear like you wear like the item on your your relic slot. It's pretty interesting. This is gonna be a scary pull, by the way. Right. So just kill the zealot. Actually, here I'm gonna. Here, here's the pressure. I damaged one mob. See, I didn't damage the yep. captain. This one should have a longer leash. Oh, see, I got trolled. Wow. So it didn't work there. But sometimes you can leash the the one. I'm just trying to left here. Actually, I think I needed to damage him again in order to do it. That was a problem. I didn't do enough damage. And you were sitting here complaining to me, Jason, about how you have totems that take up your bag space, like my hunter. Oh yeah, I gotta replace one. <laughs> hey, hey. You know how annoying it is to have four of your bag spaces taken up right now? Bruh. Do Bruh. you understand my struggle? You know I lose literally an entire bag, right? Like 16 uh, slots. It doesn't even compare. <laughs> I hate you. God. Uh, that's pretty funny. What gear do I want to make? Um, I can make rogues have a pretty rough actually too. I have to carry like two stacks of like flash poison. powder and like mining powder and some other thing too, and then poisons yeah. take up spots in your bag. It's pretty rough. Vanishing powder, blinding power, poisons, uh, thrown weapons, thieves tools. Thieves tools. Well, yeah, that's one thing. That's rough. Yeah, they do have rough. I did notice that when I started playing the rogue. Uh, as a leather worker and skinning. <laughs> Doing that grit. No, wait, wait. Here's a better one. Because I'm dual spec, I have to keep a spirit uh, set for when I go heal dungeons. It's actually so over so the top. So actually, it's like hard my to to. struggle is more. <laughs> oh, good. I'm looking at the green gear. Like I can when make. I complain about my back pain. You don't even understand my pain. I can't even wake up in the morning without crying. <laughs> Dude, the funny thing is like legit. Ah. It's almost true. Yeah, no, that's the meme. Dude, that's <laughs> how it was with my kidney stones, right? Every single day I would wake up and my back Dude, would just I, be, oh. I was actually oh. telling Leah, Jason complained about that a lot less than I would have thought. I would have been complaining every five I was five so seconds. used to back pain that I actually thought it was just my scoliosis and I didn't realize it was kidney stone. <laughs> oh, then I 
went to the doctor and like, you have kidney stones. So I was like, oh, tight. Okay, cool. <laughs> I'm going to try and play as long as possible, Storms, but my back is pretty hurt, so I don't know how long I'm going to go. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm actually dying a little bit right now. I play for a while. Perfect. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> what? Uh, it, was just, it, was just the, it was just the cherry on the top, dude. It was amazing. Why am I moving? Actually? <laughs> actually. <laughs> yeah, to say actually with a C and a K. Actually. A I get you. I yeah. get you. Actually. Uh, I need to go back and watch the Hobbs You know why? You want to know why Hobbit wasn't as proclaimed as Lord of the Rings, Ryan? You actually want to know why? The main reason? Because it was compared to Lord of the Rings. Only reason. Papa would have came out in a standalone movie that wasn't associated with Lord of the Rings at all. It would have been amazing. Okay. I agree. I disagree because... Think about it. You have no videos, Lord of the Rings lore. Anything. Even if you don't... I mean, I know we hated it more because of it. So I, do, I will say it was a little overblown. And it, was. it wasn't there was some moments like a cinematic where it was like, disaster. What is happening? But the but movie like, itself the CGI was, was a... so good. I don't. Uh, Practical yeah. effects were good. The, sh the 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 scenes were bad. Barrel, dude. Like, what is that? Like that barrel scene was rough. Yes, everyone everyone agrees. Don't. It's <laughs> so bad, and not just that. It's you kind of get lost. Hey, look. This is the. I forgot this was here. So this is the way into Undercity Storms. This is a secret way. If you look, open your map oh, you right need now. You to go into Outer City if you want to go get skinning. <laughs> we can literally go visit really Outer City right, right now if you want. Yeah. <laughs> okay, if you want to do it, I'm down. No, nah, no, nah, we're chilling. That's funny. We just ended up here. I've never <laughs> seen that naturally. I've had to go find it every time. Oh, yeah, we went in, came back out, and then done raining now. Yeah. Oh, never mind. It's yeah. It's it just takes time to transition. Tra transition. Dude, leather working is actually so AIDS because there's so much shit I have to carry. Actually retarded. Like, it's not just the leather. It's also like the threads, the dye that I have to put in the, the crap. Like the, the armor kits I keep with me. The salt. Ugh. Yeah, you got a lot of salt there, bro. Yeah, I do. Dude, I think I so make weird. cured hides. It feels so weird to be start stabbing somebody with one dagger that does six damage every like couple seconds. Like, because I'm just so used. To... When you get a second dagger, it's just nice. Dude, you gotta stuff go pick up the skinning just... knife. It's actually a good dagger for you. Like no meme. I should have this equipped. I'm literally retarded. What skinning knife? Yeah. Yeah. It's literally... it does two point two DPS. Storms, storms. Do you have the skinning knife? Yeah. No. Uh, um. He said no. Jason, you literally just made me feel like a retard. Yeah, I know. Because I just think of it as say, a tool, to right? Like, <laughs> yeah, like the fishing pole is a good pole armor. Really. Oh wait, wait, wait! It says I can't use it. It's not considered a knife. I can't use it. I can't use it. All right. Oh, because you're a rogue and you need daggers for backstab. And yeah. Stuff. There you go. <laughs> hey. Well, that it's, is yeah, it's, it's not considered a like a one-handed weapon for sinister strike either for some reason. So I don't so I don't weird. think like I can use it as like a regular weapon. I don't know. It's not considered a dagger actually. Like when you look at it, like it'll say like two hand staff. You know, this is just nothing. It's a one hand nothing. Yeah. Okay. Oh man. Uh -oh. Uh, I feel better now. I'm not retarded. All right. Yeah. Well, I mean, let's not get hasty. Okay. I could put it in my off hand though. Put in the offhand. It's true. Can't. Unless there's some other reason it's terrible. You won't be able to use offhand skills when you get them. I don't. I don't, I don't have any. Like shiv mutilate. Is, shiv I don't is, think you can get mutilate. Yeah, no game. mutilate. No shiv. No nothing. It's all main hand, boy. That sucks, dude. Water walking, Ryan, takes fish oil. <sighs> right. And water breathing takes shiny fish scales. It's like how the uh, slow fall takes the feather, dude. I love it. Yeah, but you can buy the feather. I feel like I should be allowed to buy that stuff from a vendor. 
You can buy like Onk of Reincarnation. Okay. That's another thing I have to carry. Onk. <laughs> Fuck. <Bro. laughs> If it, adds up, if it adds up to 16, all right, I'll, I'll be fair. In the early levels, dude, that is way worse than my ammo. But later on, I can't care. Like, yeah, I can't imagine not... later on. That would suck. Like, you need the max boost. What are the biggest bags you can get? 22 slots? I don't I even think know. 18 is what I have. It's endless bag, bottomless bag. I looked it up, and I think I got the biggest bags. But there might be one bigger oh, that you can get from, like, a, vent, um, a boss or something. Thousand Needles is so weird, dude. Some of the mobs are level 32 and some of them are level 24. It's madness. Um, Storms, how many uh, rings you got? I've got five right now. How many you? Six. We're getting there. Yeah, we're going away. I'm on my way. Oh, dude. Alright, look at these pants. Look at the agility on those things, dude. Oh. That's a potion, dude. You want this? Here. You should, uh, delete something that's useless for it. Yeah, let me get rid of some useless. And then that's a good thing to drag next to your bandages on the bar to the right. Being like... Down. Okay. What is this bristle bark... Riches, dude. Eight agility, dude. That's some swag. Fat, right? <laughs> I can, so, uh, I can make pants that your, give eight agility. A lot of your best in slot stuff is actually gonna have strength and agility, because that strength is just like Fact, that dude, extra. So on much top. attack power. Yeah. One strength, two attack power. Are you kidding me? Oh. I love, I love the vanilla itemization. I, I feel like maybe if I wasn't like, you know. Rose tinted goggles or something. I wouldn't, but I love it. Hyper capacitor gizmo, level 30 quest. This is an elite. What? Uh, Storms, I think I'm going to give you a macro real quick. Because I did tell you to unkeybind the auto attack, and you've probably noticed that when you're low on energy, it doesn't start your auto attack when you attack someone. So, to open up the macro pane, you just type slash M. Alright, one second. Alright. Oh, we're gonna attack. Oh, I think you can also open it by just going into the escape menu. So you can do that if you want. So for macros, to create a new macro, you're gonna go to melee specific macros. That's gonna be for that character only, because obviously it's a rogue. We don't need this on other people. You're gonna hit new. All right. And then you're gonna create a name. Just name it uppercase like sinister strike or sinister is fine. And you don't have to choose an icon. You just hit okay. Then you're going to go to that icon in there and you're going to type in the little chat window and you're mm -hmm. going to type um number show tool tip okay slash cast sinister strike oh wait no no sorry slash start attack slash cast sinister strike One after the other, right? Yeah, in that, in that order. Hit enter in between each one. The right, tooltip yeah. is what allows you to hover over it. That's considered, that's called a tooltip. So it'll, you'll still see the ability when you hover over the macro and it won't just be like a blank word. Start attack is gonna start your auto attack no matter what happens. And then Sinister Strike will just cast Sinister Strike, obviously. And then you're gonna hit the save button after that. And then you're gonna left click and drag the icon down to your bars and then you're gonna get rid of the spell so hit save hit save you're gonna right. left click and drag back or sinister sorry sinister over your okay. sinister and then you're just gonna you're gonna left click and dump the spell into the got it yeah. how fast does cap one give make you? sure you go into stealth and replace that one as well
You have to drag it out twice every time because you have it on two bikes. That's the one for stealth. Um, you want the stealth one? Okay, so you create new, right? Type stealth. Actually, uh, we'll do that one later, actually. <laughs> okay, we're chilling. Now, we should probably reload UI. Here, tell you what. Let's make you a reload UI thing. So, go to general macros. Uh, hold on. General macros, okay. General macros. Create a new one and just type, just call it reload. Okay. And then change the icon to a random one. Whatever you want to see on your bars, you can just hit that white one on the very right with the skull. That's kind of cool. Yeah. Um, and then in this one, you're just going to type slash reload into the window. Okay. And then save. And then save and just drag that next to your hearthstone. That's where I like to put it. And that one, it, so you basically get the basic idea of macros now. Macros are literally just typing in the bar. So when you hit a macro, it's technically typing all that stuff. So you can cast spells by typing. Okay. Yeah, that one for a second. Um, but now every time yeah, you want to save, you can just go it. there and hit reload. And it just reloads. Now it's on a button. That was the funniest video I've ever watched. Okay, uh... The guy did a whole raid as a healer by slash casting his abilities. All right. I Some, remember that. My cousin, he just messaged me. He's apparently, he played back in 2004, like when fucking WoW released and shit, like vanilla. And uh, he's playing it now. Nice. That just hibernated a beast. Wow, what Jason, a man. do you know if there's a way to make it so that escape doesn't actually like untarget? Because that's like the most annoying thing to me. I don't know. Because I always want to open my menu without losing my target. Because I'm changing something while attacking. You gotta hit the button, dude. Yeah, I. It's just annoying. Oh, these guys! I hate when two people are skinning. It's like, stop stealing my leather, dog. Did I? No, I didn't finish the. Still at six. We. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, at least there's no one else here, Storms. We're just farming. <laughs> Rockfighter oh, gives me nice. so much aggro. It's. Money to shift. Good. Oh, he had a falling out with his old. He had a falling out with his old guild, so he's just running solo right now. That sucks. That does suck. Can you hit Perrin? I'm gonna die probably. You gotta hit him. I'm hitting him. I'm trying. <laughs> Hit him with that dagger, yo. Okay, I'm gonna wait a bit to backstab him. Pussy down. That pussy down. I'll break that pussy down. That's what he says. He says, I brick that pussy down. Oof. Look at the there double backstab, go. dude. What's up? So the, the general tip to Rogue is that sometimes it's better to pool your energy and go for a burst window with like 100 rather than just using it every time. That's like a PvP. Hey, Ryan. Tip. What level is your hunter? Sorry, hunter is level right 16. You're good. Okay. Oh, he has a level 13 hunter. Cool. Is he, he on our server? server? Yeah, he's on uh, Fairbanks. And he's your horde? Uh. Yeah. Ask him real quick. Oh, by the way, cannibalize is really nice because it's basically free food. So I'm cannibalizing this guy right now because he's a humanoid rather than eating. I can't realize that bubble. Wow. I would never. Weak. Yeah, he's gonna, yeah, he's forward. Storms. This guy doesn't eat ass. Who? Ryan. Oh, dude, what? Sorry, friend. <laughs> oh, dude, I, dude, I've legitimately eaten ass. It's pretty good. 
Oh, no. Jesus Christ, Storms. No. <laughs> it's just another hole. Yeah, stop making like me your mouth. think about it. Please make me stop. Dude, it's like, what's the difference between kissing a mouth dude, and eating that? No, no joke. Nothing. Dude, put some peanut butter on that bit. Oh, yeah. Oh, God, dude. Slather it like oh, Nutella. Oh, God. <laughs> Even better. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Fat Max Dab. Oh. Eating the tail out of ass, dude. Ain't nothing better. Chocolate, chocolate icing. Oh. Uh, Dribble some melted chocolate. On please, ass. please, please. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. I'm poop diddy scoop. <laughs> scoop diddy poop diddy poop. Uh, <laughs> That's my biggest pet peeve right now in what in classic. Uh huh. What? That don't loot animal corpses, so I can't skin them. <laughs> dude, you're literally looking at them. It's me, dude, because I can't freaking pick it up. Fat bitch. <laughs> uh. You know what's really funny that I do? When I'm running around in Ghost Wolf form, if I see someone attacking something, I'll just like walk by and auto attack it, and sometimes I'll just crit it for like yeah. 200 damage, and it's just like it just dies, and people are like, "What the fuck?" That's sad, <laughs> dude. I, I help you out. If it doesn't cost me nothing, heck yeah, I'll help you out. The problem I have but is I on my hunter, use. I've started to realize that when I help people out with my ranged weapon, I'm literally spending money. Yeah, I'm asking if he has Discord. Uh, Jason, he's a he's a good dude. I'll vouch for him if you, if it's cool. If I can, can just like invite him to our uh, vanilla Discord we have. That's Yeah, that'd be perfect then. It's like a gathering place where people post about yeah. their vanilla shit and like where they hang out if they want to. Usually they don't. He's a good dude. He doesn't, have, he doesn't do drama or anything like that, so he'd be perfect to like... Chill. No, I don't care if he joins, I'm just saying. Yeah. <sighs> What's that song called? Uh... Dude, that song, I was watching s and I heard the song Opus for the first time, dude. You heard that? They play it on Twitch sometimes, and I guess Twitch chat really likes it. Um, Opus song? It was Tridance? pretty hype, dude. Yeah, yeah. It was pretty hype, dude. It's a nine-minute song. It, it takes, it's a long build-up, but heck is it good, dude. Like, I was feeling it. I was feeling it. I guess it's the same guy who did call on me, but I'm not, I didn't like verify that. All right, he's adding me on Discord. And... You know you can make folders for Discord now? Folders? Yep. For your servers. You just drag over one of them. Really? Oh my, that is happening right now, I think. Uh, you know what? what is know. I've gotten used to it, so maybe not. Do, 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 do. Da, da, da. How do I make one? Did I actually feel like you made the perfect choice going shaman? Like everything I know about what you like to play, like it totally makes sense. <laughs> Two sneaky boys. <laughs> What? <laughs> I'm sne- <laughs> miss. <laughs> and I crit right after you miss. Make up for it. I'll do the oh, damage. Oh, my last sure. ring right there. I need uh, one more. Nah. Oh, man. Let's see. <laughs> Headset's almost done charging. <laughs> that dude's name is Jahils. <laughs> Jahils. People Daniels, have some really a, good names, dude. Yeah. We could have stolen that, actually, if we wanted. Yeah, we could, we could have, yeah. It's fine. Yeah, no, I'm not, I'm not going to be too much of a jerk. He, he deserves yeah. it. He's got the name, dude. Yeah, he is, man. Yeah, he is, man. Let's head out here real quick and, uh... Me some I need fun. the I need the coarse thread. But I don't know where the fuck you get that. We shit. buy that. We buy it. I'm gonna do right here. 
When it comes to humanoids, if you don't want them to pull more, if you're having trouble by yourself, you want to use like your slows and stuns when they're low health, or you pull up energy so you can get a big eviscerate off. So you got to play a little bit different against people that run away. Dude, I don't remember these dusk bat pelts being this hard to get. Uh, you're gonna get an ability called uh, Evasion Sandstorms. When it comes to evasion, a lot of people like to use it when they get to low health, but it's better to like notice that you're dropping and use it when you're getting hit by two enemies because you're getting double the value, right? You're dodging both enemies rather than like trying to take on a lot and then getting evasion on like one enemy at the very end. Yeah. So that's an easy mistake for new players to use evasion when they're getting low rather than to realize that, oh, this is three enemies. I should use it right now at the start. Yeah. Nice. Three, five. Yeah, I just need, I just need one that, that help. Okay, I need four. By the way, with all these keybinds I just set up with you, like, if you don't remember them right now, it's fine. You can still click the abilities if you have to, right? And you just have yeah, the keybinds yeah. there, like, for when you finally get sick of clicking. You're like, wait, what was that keybind again? Yeah, thankfully, uh, I have it all kind of, like, down pretty good, so I'm not worried about it. Yeah. Oh, so if you're wondering what abilities I put where, um, on the far left, where it's R and 1 and 2, right? That's gonna be my, uh, that's your, like, offensive cooldowns, like, Adrenaline Rush, and, like, like things that have a three minute cooldown that give you a bunch of damage for a while. Um, and then the second section that I have cut out, where it's Shift G, F, and 4, that's gonna be defensive ability. So, like, I put Evasion on F, I put Vanish on Shift G, um, Shift F can be something else that you have to get out of trouble. That's a decent sword. You should take that, by the way. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of some shit. We're gonna use that later, probably. <laughs> oh my god, I accidentally freaking stutter stepped and canceled. Do it. Point one seconds. Rest in peace, dude. I do that a lot with my hunter because it's a little off because of classic. <laughs> Being laggy. Um, so. A defensive section is that second one, Storms. And then the next section, G, is uh, what I put Sprint on. It's always my movement ability. And then, um... T is kind of like an ugly keybind. It's like 5. It's not that useful. So, 5 and T are going to be Plus. things I don't hit very often. So for me, five is expose armor, which is something you're gonna use very rarely. But when you need it, it's good to have it on keybind. So five is great for, for expose armor. And then T, I think I have my secondary gouge. There's a there's a gouge macro I'll give you that lets you bandage like right away. So I tend to put that there for now. Um, because you use it, you only want to use that in PvP. I mean, I guess you can use it in PvE as well. I don't know. So I keep like certain types of abilities. So if you ever play another character besides a rogue, like like you're playing a mage, if you want to know what to put stuff on, like G is your movement ability, that's where you'd put blink, right? And four is where I put blind, that's where you'd put sheep. Um, okay. Like that kind of, like that's the that's the general idea behind the keybinds. Um, something like C that goes stealth here, right? There's no stealth for mages. So what you would use instead is you put something like arcane intellect on C, which is something that you cast before fighting that gives you a buff. So buffs are good on C, like like setup abilities are good on X and C. Something you're not gonna like press all the time, but still easy to hit. 
I think I'm probably gonna put my poison poisons on shift Z. So I probably set that keybone up myself too. Oh wait, actually I don't need to because unclickable button. Um, I still don't have that ring. Let's see if this pulls both. Yeah. <laughs> I like how Yerkes comes right after mine, the little dagger. John Heels knows what's up. He hit the mob that we didn't hit. Fool knows what he's doing. Dang it. No ring. Maybe I should have tagged that mob. Yeah. Oh, this guy's back. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at that. That's that's really strange. Like that kind of spawning is like what is going on? I wonder if it's a layering issue. Nah, layers are getting kind of population, yeah. or you're getting moved to a new layer and you don't realize it, and something happens and wow, that's fun. That would be interesting. You you could be right. I was thinking it's just bad spawning code, but. I'm gonna see if I can pull this chick. Oh. Oh, it worked out. Is this name Jeebus Cru Oh my gosh, look at his name. Jeebus Christ. Jeebus Christ, huh? That's cool. Not the best name I've seen so far, though. It's not, it's spelled totally different. I mean, respect. that one belongs to uh, a really, really good name. I can't remember what it was. Man, dude, how you many? You know what I wanted? What? Ryan, this is gonna be my old name. Hey, my headset's ready. That's gonna be in the name, dude. My days. <laughs> That's good. I like it a lot. This. <laughs> I like that. Oh man. <laughs> I got the ring, sweet. Uh, now I just need right. one blood and two pelts. I just need one pelt and then we're good. Meme from a long time ago, I heard. That's, it's like a new prescription of Cialis or Viagra. My Dixadryl. What did, I saw did I I saw a name that was like that. Were we talking about it? I don't remember. Oh yeah, it was Dicks be flopping. That's what it was. Dicks be flopping, dude. <laughs> did you send the name to Storms you should show him? Mine? Yeah. I can't carry it. It's funny. Oh, I already have all the dark bound blood. I'm done. Alright, I just found my... I found the pelt. So, um, no. I'm good whenever you are. And they said you buy the course thread, right? Yeah, it's from the vendor. I forgot, honestly, but that's probably good because you don't want it in the bags, so... Uh, I think most of the bats are this way, if I remember right. That's the, that's the name I'm going for, Storms. My dick's a drill. Hell yeah. <laughs> Are you from Garin Logon or something? Oh, he got it, did he? Yeah, he did. Yeah, actually, both those warlocks were fighting over that with a dot. Which is... If you if you use a dot on someone, it doesn't get tagged right away. By the way, so like, you wanna oh oh don't walk oh no no. You uh you only get the tag if you do damage. Oh, okay. There should be a bunch of bats here if I remember right. Aha.
Jason, do you know why some people show up in green on their names and some people show up in blue? You know, I looked it up a long time ago. And I used to know. I, I, I remember asking the same question. Figured maybe you'd remember. Actually, I don't know if we found an answer. We found an answer to something else, but it wasn't that, I think. There should be a billion bats somewhere. Oh. Aha. I know the bat. Oh, these bats stun you. I forgot that these bats stun you because uh, on the private server, I think it was bugged, they would use their abilities over and over again. So you'd always get stunned, but you don't get nearly as many This guy says blue here. equals same or opposite faction, non pv flag, green same faction, PvP. Yellow is opposite faction, they have PvP flag, but you are not PvP flag, so they cannot attack you. Red is opposite faction, PvP flag. Wait, wait, wait. So which one? which one's PvP flag, green or blue? It's green. <laughs> But because we're in a PvP server, we're all green. Not always. So if you can you're disable in, or enable a PvP, right? But it doesn't matter yeah, on a PvP so, server. So the only reason I would see it then is if we're in a non-PvP area and someone is flagged, then I'd see them as green with everyone else being blue. Seems like it. Yeah. So it depends on bleed PvP. Cool. Thank you. I want to try and remember that. Because I think if you heal someone that's green, then you'll get flagged for PvP. Maybe. Maybe. Give me your pelts! Oh my goodness, not one, dude. Ah, dang it. If you ever want to stop your auto attack, you just uh, left click off of someone and back on, by the way. For real, it's super annoying. I really want to see if the repost macro works, so I'm excited for you to get to like level, is it 20 you get repost? Actually. Uh, who's a rogue in your um, friend group again? Rots. Playing rogue. Oh, Ice Nine kills? That's actually like my favorite man. <laughs> I'm not even lying. Also, if you're in a group with people, your name goes to like lighter green. And people out of like outside of the group are like a forest green. You still need that the pelts? Run. Yeah, yeah, sorry. I'm texting a uh, message yeah, someone yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. macro. He doesn't know nothing about macros, my guy. Except for I can't carry anymore. Man, we have killed so many bats. <laughs> Yeah. How many how many bat wings? <laughs> I need two more, dude. Oh Pets. my god. <laughs> hey look. A rope. Right. Yeah, dude, I've been really unlucky with these. I mean like we have to walk to a whole new area now. You know what? 
tell you what. I'm going to have you turn in the quest, and you're going to let me know whether or not you get a new quest from it. Sorry, one sec. I got one pelt from that, so I don't know. Yeah, one pelt from that. Alright. Nope. Oh, we got more belts. Yeah. We got more bat spending in the spawning. Oh, Alright. I like how the voice for orcs in vanilla WoW is the same as Hunters of Warcraft 3. It's the same as the what from Warcraft 3? Demon Hunters. Like, Illidan, you know? Really? Yeah. How about that? Come on, give me the pelt. Give me your pelt. Look at that dude just fly. Where are you going? Oh my gosh, Ryan. <laughs> Start attack macros are so broken for tagging mobs. I have noticed this start attack is janky. It does not work all the time. Anyway, I didn't get it. Okay. Dude, I so I'll just put like my flame shock on my mouse wheel, right? And I'll just yeah. sit there and just like scroll it, and then like as soon as the thing spawns, boom! Oh, you're saying instantly you actually... tag it? Yeah, because it automatically targets, right? So if nothing's there, yeah. it'll automatically target the first thing spawns. So I'll always get the target on the mob I'm looking for. Apparently, the best one is explosive trap. It's like literally instant damage. So I haven't tried it before. Explosive or the. Immolation trap isn't that great because it doesn't tick right away. Well, the yeah, um, cool thing about I'm, Flame Shock is does it do instant it damage? Takes, yeah, it does instant then dot damage. So, I mean, I could use like Earth Shock, but Flame Shock works just as well. Yeah, dude. Um, I've heard the the best tagging thing is what, what's that Moon Moonbeam? What is, what is it called? Moonfire. Moonfire, because it's got the longest range and it's the same as Flame Shock, right? With instant damage. Yeah. I also put down like a magma totem that pulses every two seconds for 20 seconds. Just in case. Makes sense. Big brain. Big brain. Big brain. We should do a test to see. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Alright. The row. So, do you want to use our hearths now or are we going to use it later? Let's use it. Let's use it after the next quest. We have to go yeah. to the north side of the map. That That's your right. Area. Here, just run. Yeah, I'm running. So see how I gouged him, just ran away. La, la, da, 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 da. The the scroll wheel mouse shift mouse down is really nice for just like jumping in the air and then spinning around to like hit something hitting you. And gouge Ooh. it and run away. This is America. This Don't call me slipping up. This is Guess a who I'm whipping wheel. up. This is a chicken wing. Ryan. Yeah. No. Come Bad on. Ryan. Come on. Bad boy. This is You're a, a cuck. Please not. Ah, uh, yes. Turn that in there. Those potions are pretty cool. You can just use one. They're not like particularly good or anything. Hey, eat. So. Let's slap some change together and go to freaking... level nine, boy. We're getting there. What now? Some pretty good bracers. I'm gonna sell because I'm full first. Speak quickly. I have a lot of meat. Um, or dagger? No, 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 no. Keep the little advantage. Sell the little advantage. Keep the little bit. Sell. Make sure you make all your linen bandages. It's a good time to make them. Oh, and this chick has the coarse thread, by the way. <sighs> Don't catch it slipping now.
when the linen bandage recipe turns green, you should stop making them. Storms. Hmm. That's interesting. Do I take six intellect, two stamina, three spirit, five strength, five stamina? Probably well, five strength, five uh, Too many numbers. Yeah, I think so. These are all bad. I'm just going to take the money. All right. I'm going to go train real quick. I'm one point away from me being able to train the new first aid recipe. That's a little... Hmm. Get the... Okay, Ryan. Here's the real one. Five strength, five stamina, five spirit, or four agility, nine stamina, three spirit. It's got to be the... You, you got to link. Right? I literally... I just can't... I tried really hard. I, I tried really hard, dude, but I'm freaking... Scatterbrain. So I'm guessing we get Eviscerate and. Oh, yeah. Get both of those. Those are some good spells. No, which one do I wear? Probably the agility one. I was Agility's supposed to be my main uh, stats. So. How much better is agility than strength? A lot better. Apparently. A lot better. Well, it gives you crit. Yeah. Is the. Well, it gives me attack power as well. With range that's, weapons. All right. That's freaking nine stam, right? Like, that's. That's so much stamina. That's amazing. Yeah, it's Bronhide. Because right, what you're telling me. If agility is better than strength, then yeah. This guy just gave me two heavy armor kits. I think literally though, if it was the other way, if it was five agility on that, I would I would wear the agility. I'll probably hold on to that though, because in PvP you want as much damage as you can get. I haven't uh, got no. all day. PPP me PP. Well, the thing about crit is, I have flurry, so I need to crit. Right. My pet does that too, actually. Flurry Zombies is so embracers. I am forsaken. Beware the living. Okay. Um. I think we need to go down here first to pick up this quest. Right. What's pretty funny is I turn all my medium leather into. Heavy. This is just useless for me. I forgot you could do that. Y'all. I need I need heavy hide though. This stuff's so rare. So I make heavy armor kits now. Dope. Does this have to be a certain level to use it? Yeah, heavy is 15, medium is, uh, no. Goodbye. No level. Yep, and then we go back to talk. You want my medium armor? <laughs> I actually like leveling undead 1 to 10 a lot more than, uh, Duratar. Ugh, it's so slow. Duratar one? Yeah. Well, I'd rather level in Silver Pine than go to freaking Barons. I think I like the first couple quests of Silver Pine, but after that, they went to crap. At least that was on retail. I I'm not. Legitimately hate Barons so much. <laughs> it's the worst questing zone in the game. I feel like it feels bad, but when you think about it objectively, it's not that bad. But it feels bad. Hello, Magistrate. Seven. Take a deal. This is America. I just sold uh, tw a stack of silk bandages for 40 silver. But. Here, I'm going to follow you. Um, so you look at the map. You have to follow. You have to go to that north place where that's blank to the left. On the other side of that uh, ridge of mountains. Garen's haunt. Oh, the other side of the. Oh, okay. I know exactly what we're talking about. All right. I'll be right back. Um, you can turn to the right and walk through here, Storms. I just want to aggro all the ravaged corpses. Mm -hmm. I'll ravage your corpse. It doesn't matter. You can always gouge them and just run away. See, look. If I ever yeah. pull one, yeah, I can just gouge them and run away. Easy peasy. Mm, okay. Helps a lot. And we have evasion now, so you can just evasion and run away too. 
You should drag that under your bars to F, by the way. I forgot to tell you to do that. Ah, okay. Um, and eviscerate, since we are a rogue, we don't have to worry about dragging the new version of the spell to our bars. But if you are playing a different class, if you get a new rank, it won't automatically take that rank to your bars. You can always check. You can hover over Eviscerate since it's ranked 2 now. It's going to do mad damage, yo. Ooh. And Evasion is stupid good. It starts out good. Like, it's actually kind of weird. I did that from behind. Did you see that? What? Yeah, I saw that. That's kind of nutty. How did I do that? Is that good? Just that good? So we here, we? we need... These things. I'm going to reload UI to, to reload Questy so I can see where everything is. My boy Jason with the hot tips. I guess I'm going to kill these Bonecaster boys right here. These uh, bounty boys. Uh, when you hover over them, does it does it show you if you need to kill them? Like, if you hover over it, the tooltip at the bottom right, does it say three blackened skulls? Mm, I don't think so, no. Oh, that must be questy. Dude, that's a big... So, right now, you don't know what you have to kill. You have to look, but I can literally just hover over them, and I can see that I have a quest for them. Okay. So, yeah, we'll get you questy at some point. Yeah. We actually out-level this. What the heck? You want to see a yeah, real chess piece, Ryan? I guess we should have done this earlier. Panther armor. Ooh. 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 That's some hot stuff, man. Oh, boy. The shame is that strength is pointless on my hunter. Completely. Some notch ribs, boy. Mm, yeah. Rest the head. I'll wrap your strike, dude. Um, yeah, there's like a small benefit, but um, in raids, you'll never use that. But in PvP, like, I mean, I honestly think you'd rather have intelligence. Because you boys have more. Spawning in, they just. I so I mean, yeah, this is what I was talking about. But it's nice sometimes, and if you're in a group, it's great because you can take on everything. So something you do right now is, if you don't want them to cast, you can interrupt them with gouge at the very end of their cast time. I guess you can't see guess, cast time. Guess so. where I just got to? Where? Mirage Waste Raceway. Deja vu. You know where I'm, you know where that is? Yeah, of course. Yeah. With all the gnomes that for some reason are friendly. I didn't want a quest down here. I'll need help with this guy, Storms. This guy's really oh, hard. No. Here he comes. Just get behind him and uh, start backstabbing. Is there no, there's no oh. freaking flight. He doesn't cast. Here, is oh, on the private service, he would cast fat shadow bolts, dude. Make that sure is a level him. 31 paladin. I'm gonna go get this peace bloom. Yeah, I like this undead star area a lot. Bro, there's no flight path in freaking Mirage Raceway. I said. In the shimmering flats. Oh god, too. Bye, bye. I need, uh... I think... I think it's a bug. I think this... The music for... The Undead Zone is more quiet than it should be. I have it turned all the way up and I can literally barely hear it.
Bonecaster. It's a cool name. Oh, Fucking dagger spawn. did. Did you see that insta spawn? Yeah. Am I gonna die here? There's a question mark, question mark, freaking Night of Druid here. Oh. Um, do you have a three blackened skulls? I just need one more and three notch ribs. Okay, I need two notch ribs, but I'm good with skulls. I think these guys dropped the skulls, right? Yeah, they do. Don't forget you have evasion if you ever get low or get scared, you know. Yeah. Oh, we're scared. Whoa. By the way, you don't always have to click to target. If you press the um just any of your abilities, it should auto target the closest enemy. Or just and tap it, target. It goes it, it targets directly in front of you, by the way. So wherever you face with your right mouse button is what you will target. So if you ever have trouble targeting something specifically, just make sure you point directly at it and there's nothing between you and them. Um, should go this way. Yeah, Thurman's over here. My dad's watching the boys right now downstairs. <laughs> watching boys downstairs? The boys. Oh god. Job bells. Yeah, yeah. I had to make a joke. It's a great show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> See, I used evasion when there was two of us. Now I have like full health still. These guys are level 9. Okay, that's the right area. Okay, we're looking for Thurman. And we want to make sure... Oh, I think he's this way. If you see Thurman, tag him right away, whatever you're doing. He should be right around here-ish. Man, this dude has dodged my eviscerate twice. Just dumped my energy. When you open up your talents page, it makes a noise. I tagged Thurman with a skull. Oh, he's way over there. You see the skull? Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. Um, so the way I did that is I typed slash target Thurman. So if you ever have a lot of trouble finding a named mob, you can type in their exact name. And if it's close, you'll target it. If it's not, then you know that he's not up or something. And then I used six to put a skull on him. Inventory is full. Okay, now we need Gregor's remains. This way. Can I do stockades? No. I Lines. would. Yeah. <laughs> Getting in there would be an interesting experience. 
Gregor is dead. We'll have to wait for him to respawn. That's what I said about your mom, Ren. How could you? He's speechless. Food, great. I literally have no bag space. <laughs> oh, it was more mushrooms. Well, um. Well, well, well. Did you get a letter to Yvette in your inventory? Yeah, I got that. I got, well, I have Thurman's letter. But I read it, and then if you accept it, it turns into Thurman's letter. I think. Yeah. Oh, I literally can't do it because my inventory is full. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gosh, that is annoying. Um, stump this. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Holy shit, there's a freaking pole arm that comes from Zolgrub. That's just a pitchfork. Uh. Oh, new uh, error somewhere. Uh, uh, there's a skull. Uh, skull. Uh, <laughs> oh, there it is. Uh, oh. As a shaman, what gear do I receive from Molten Oh my god, I'm missing literally. I know. My... <laughs> <laughs> it helps if you stand behind him, because then he can't at least parry. <laughs> but sometimes yeah. that's all you get. Now my inventory is full of four different types I of skulls. Need, I just need one not shrib. I need two, and we need to kill yeah. Nisa this way. Ryan, three piece for shamans from Molten Core. So good. I need to make a bag slot. Uh, I don't want to use up this linen. Just, just do you care? Just the two of us. Target Nisa. Freaking racist, right? Six. She's inside, right there. Ah, she's right there. Go, go pull her, actually. Go, go pull her. Go pull her. Family. And run away. Just run away. You can gouge her, too, if you want. Keep running, keep running. You're getting attacked by another mob. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Watch out, watch out. That's a rare. Okay, let's kill her and let's kill the rare. Yeah. I'm gonna pull this rare, which is a little crazy, but I want it. Gotta go kill that other mob that's killing you. Alright, oh, right, I'll, I'll hit it, I'll hit it, I'll hit it. I'll target oh. it. Yeah. Hey, dude. Look at us. Freaking doing it. Wow, you just crit her mouth off. Didn't you? Make sure you get Nisa's remains. Yeah, I got her shit. Yep. Wispy cloak, dude. It's got one more armor. It was worth it. <laughs> you want that? Wispy cloak? Nah, I'm chilling. Okay. Heck yeah, dude. I'm wispy. Oh, man. And I think not ribs. Oh, we need not ribs. Uh, yep, just one. Like, uh, it drops off the warriors. Yeah, it cracks skull soldier, I think. Bah. Thank you. 
I might stop using my throwing knife twice. I, I, it's a habit for me because it just makes the fights go better, but I'm like eating through the small throwing knife. My ball. Alright, let's turn this shit in because my inventory is cancer. I need, I need one more, so. I need one more? Alright. I mean, Lord knows why they didn't make throwing weapons like a weapon and then like you have a resource to keep casting it like a like an ammo. I mean, I know that's weird, but you got it. Yes. Um, but we need to go do vile fin scale quest real quick. Oh, actually, no. Oh. We can do it <laughs> up here. We have like so much cancer shit in our backpack right now. <sighs> this is kind of cancer how we do this. All right, yeah, let's go. <laughs> Alright, we her starting it up? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, boy. I'm listening. Like right next to the quest, nice. Trust no one. Oh, right here, right here. What do you require? Thurman's letter. Lady, watch over wow, you. that chick, read that quest when you turn it in. Like, literally, she, you go find her husband's remains, and she's just like, well, he was weak. <laughs> like, Jesus. Metal. Metal. Oh, where is it? On the right floor? It's on the first floor to the. It's like. Hard to find, but it's there. First floor oh. near the entrance. Oh, yeah. I just got really hungry. I should go finish my sandwich. Hopefully, no one ate it. What is it? This had better be good. I am forsaken. All right. Turn in this quest. We have another quest to go up there. Right. Right. That quest is hard. We'll do that <laughs> next. Uh, on this quest over here, take the male boots. They're worth more. Wow, you're just going, Aiden. I just had, uh, just had some ginger ale, you know what I'm saying? Sounds good. My throat hurts, actually. Stop sucking so much dick. What is it? Wouldn't that help it? No. Makes it much worse. Oh. Hmm. Thank you. User experience, right? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. We're like literally one bar from ten. Oh you got I'm 10, actually buddy. I'm actually ten. <laughs> well you little <laughs> Yeah. Now call yeah. Ryan a bit now give him the slash rude symbol in game and fart on him. Actually, it's a, it does the uh, like arm flip off thing, I think, for the undead. Hey. Uh, ding, ding, ding. <sighs> Do you know what's crazy? The wowhead guides for like classic leveling are actually lit. Really? Yeah, they're clean. Top, top things you shouldn't miss while leveling. Complete your rogue quest to get access to poisons or recipes for thistle tea. You lack innate health regen, so carrying lots of food and bandages is a fundamental way to fishing. Oh, Storms, you have a talent point. Yeah, that's what I was trying to N. find for him. Oh. What should I dump it into? Uh, hold on. Um, the combat tree? Put it Maybe. in Sinister Strike Energy Cost Reduction. Yeah, you're, you're right, you're right. Great. Then you do improve gouge. Yes, yes you do. Some people go like evasion, but they're non-PVP pansies. I uh, I actually take evasion in my build as an as a enhancement because it's better than everything else. Um, or not like it, the... like dodge chance, not evasion. Yeah, I think you take that later on. Um... You go thirty-two into combat, nineteen into assassination, huh? Yeah, you just go down combat and you go a weird combat Next path so you can pick a repost. Funneled into precision. That makes sense. Yeah, so, um, so if I could give you one thing, it should be that 
your best stat by far is hit percent and your second best stat is crit percent if you right. have a talent point that looks boring but it says one percent hit that shiz is fire because how much does it suck to miss your backstabs if you really think about it you've been playing the game for like what six hours you've already complained about it <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to missing. Not ready yet. These Murlocs, they're pretty brutal. Never underestimate Murlocs. Because they like to run around. So like you'll pick up patrols on accident all the time. They tend to have a lot of casted abilities. And we're gonna be here a while. We gotta get five scales each. I just got one, so. <laughs> uh, there's one up there. Go upstairs. Guess what? I gotta put into my upstairs. next uh, talent point, Ryan. I have to run away. That guy's gonna watch him get lightning bolt. Killing the guy up here. Oh, he got another lightning bolt off. What a madman. Oh, there's tinnitus. Oh, I wish I had sprint. Dude, yeah, that happens to me sometimes. Ryan, I get a, uh, I get parry from my next talent point. You know the trick to get rid of the ringing, by the way, if it never goes yeah. away? Not listen to loud music when I was younger in my ears? No, no, the, the trick to making tinnitus go away. You What you do is you, uh, here, I'll send you a video. It apparently it works. I just like nut into a freaking bowl of Cheerios. I'm getting peace. Run. I got you, I got you, I got you. Where is he? I'm not behind the rock over here. Two oh, there's two of them. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, I'm going You're gonna get another lightning bolt. If you need to, gouge. And then just sit. You can actually gouge and then bandage. That's the pro strat. Oh, don't go pull someone else, please. Bad, Dang it. I should've just came over and helped you. Oh, He's okay. out of mana now, so it's easy for me to kill him. You just gotta run. So you gotta, you gotta release and then run back. It's fine. It actually won't slow us down that much because, uh... Wait, did you release? No, I didn't. Yeah, you gotta release. Oh, I start did? Oh. Yeah, start running, boy. Oh, fuck me. Yeah, welcome to death. Welcome to Classic WoW. Just run in the direction of your corpse, son. Sheesh. She, bro, let me get her dead. Shiz, but I pulled three on accident, really? Oh, stop spawning on me, please. I miss on my backstab, dude. Ugh. Kill me. As a rogue, you need to learn bows, crossbows, fist weapons, guns, one handed maces, and weapon swords. Interesting. Is that everything you should or everything you can? Can. So, your best tool right now for surviving storms, especially against casters, is just gouge and sit the whole you duration. You can only use daggers and throw before you kill something. So. And you can gouge repeatedly. So you can gouge, wait for the cooldown to come back, and just gouge again. Because it's free damage, right? Think about it. You get 20 energy every 2 seconds. So that means in 4 seconds, you gain 40 energy. Gouge costs 45. So essentially, if you wait the whole duration, it costs 5 energy. And it does 10 damage. So even though it looks like it does no damage, it's doing 10 damage for 5 energy and putting a huge timer on the fight. Hmm. Which will let me help you. Can you put a timer on a fight? That's when you gouge, bandage like a man. Yeah, and that's the, the real trick. And the trick is to gouge and then immediately bandage yourself. My which balls. makes it even better for you because it's... I mean, you're doing damage for five energy and then healing yourself. A leather worker? Oh, as a leather Storm, worker, you should have that potion I gave you. <laughs> that is retarded. Oh. Uh, yeah, do you have it on your bars? 
Yeah, I do. There's a quest I can do, Ryan, that gives me a, a pattern to make six slot bags as a leather worker. <laughs> By the way, Storms, you lost your buff from the potion because you died, so you can reuse it. Actually, I might have got rid of them because I was fucking literally out of space. Huh. I wonder if I can... Can I trade this dude? Dope. Wait, oh. You don't have space, right? Okay, you chill. Oh, uh, yeah, shit. <laughs> I may have to get a uh, fear in like a minute. Okay, that's fine. Or just like, yeah. It's gonna I'm be totally fine with that. I remember there's a rare mob out here somewhere. I should know what it was called. You saw a level 27 human paladin running through Barrens. What a man. Girl. Really got me. Oh. Save one more scale. Two more. Oh, that's three. Oh boy. Yeah, you got that strafing down, I see. His little feet paddling when he was running away. I'm at, I'm at all five. I need two. You can run back if you want, if you need to get off. I can finish this. Alright. Yeah, here. Yeah, go run back. Turn in the vile fin quest and then get your spells from the trainer and then just log out in the end at the trainer. Alright. Oh, what a photo, Jacob. Hello? He's a square. Hey. What's going on? Howdy, partner. Got a mic. Still shit. Classic. Wonderful. Marion Call. I don't know what quest that is. Alright, gentlemen, I will be back. Hasta la mañana. How long are you till you're back? Uh, probably 30, 45. Should okay, I probably cool. won't be able to play anymore again tonight with you. Should have stayed there. Right. You can level down me, though. Do it. Ryan, just slow me down. Dust. Leave him in the dust. Our time. He's like a ball and chain. La 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 bitch. You're not wrong. Except the ball's made of some more uh, movable material. Oh, dude, we got a dual wield, Storms. Heck yeah. Oh, shit. That's actually little. Dual wielding is fun. <laughs> This weird trick, this is like a freaking chive article, dude. I uh, dude, I I like you know that they just literally <laughs> copied someone else put it there, but like that's what I found first. Facts. So. It's just AIDS. It's like these ten tricks that'll help you live longer. Fuck off. How to check if your hair this is like the ads that are on the left hand side. How to check if your hair loss is within normal limits. How to charm someone you've never met before. Three myths about sparkling water debunked. 
<laughs> you spoke in your perfect, mouth. Dude. I swear you say it so perfect. <laughs>